Something tells me we'll be leveling up this time. Well, we'll be getting to HP soon enough. Yo, yo, YouTubers. Welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. Last time we rescued the Yoshi kids. Yeah, that's really it. So now we gotta go talk to the Yoshi Elder. Or Chief, as the case may be. Just ignore Colorado. Because right now, he has something for us. What, you have warping power, Sushi? Alright. So, so we appreciate the fact that we saved the Yoshi kids. And I need this, this Raven statue. He gives us the Jade Raven. Which is really just some statue made of Jade, I guess. I don't know. So yeah, he's telling us the whole story and everything. Sushi is surprised that we're going to Mount Lava Lava. She objects it, and eventually she decides to come with us. Now, in my in my guidebook, there was something that said that I'm able to get another Happy Heart Badge through the Jade Raven, but I'm not quite sure how. So at the moment, I'm gonna do a little experimenting. Up here, you see a lot of ravens. Let's see. Do I have to, have to talk to one of them to get that get that badge? Okay, I guess not. Well, we'll figure it out eventually. So for now, let's get back to J Jungle. Not much talking going on, I'm sorry about that. Free coin. Was there something in here? Yeah, company! And this time we got him. Now I remember what Sushi's other ability is. Water block. It creates a cube of water to boost Mario's defenses. It's pretty much like um, Watt's third ability that, that she picks up on, on super rank. Only it works on defense instead of offense. Which means it pretty much has the same action command. Just watch. How Mario was able to breathe under there, I don't know. Then again, how he's able to breathe underwater altogether, I don't know. How do you like that? Even with Defense Plus on and that water block, Jungle Fuzzy actually pierces through the defenses. How do you like that? And I'm not liking this, uh... Star Storm! Yeah, that was weak. You can tell how much I hate the fuzzies. So I know Sushi's third power, uh, attack or whatever. Now we got a duck and cup. Um. You see how Mario was laid out on Sushi back there? Oh well. What the heck is this supposed to mean? Oh well. Was there something here needed? I guess not. So I'll put the Jade Raven down there. Like, holy cow. That's something you don't see every day. Can you remove the Jade Raven? I guess not. Now we're deeper in the deeper in Jade Jungle. I jump on these vines to pull them down, and you get items. Sometimes. Right now we got an egg. Um. Yeah, I'm keeping the egg. There will be reasons for that later. And I missed again. Well, that was long. At least it's a good thing I decided to cut out these battles. Hmm. 
Now uh, here's an interesting puzzle. You gotta move these blue blocks here. Cover that water. Cover those water spouts. Now this area is so full of puzzles, ain't it? Now I saw in the speed run of this game that this guy pretty much covered up all the holes before um, covering the first water spout, which I think is quite an achievement. Or something. Oh, something's happening. Wow. That's actually one powerful water spout. And it's blocking our way, so we might as well block it. <laughs> Get it? Alright, we got more vines here. Was there something Walk can find here in the jungle? I'm sure there was. Hmm, guess not. Uh, just what I always wanted. Oh, come on! Well, we're almost there, po uh, folks. Oh, we got a fire flower now. Mm, let's see. <sighs> yep, I'm not giving that thing up easily. Yeah, 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 heal up. Come on, come on, I don't want to lose it. Thank you. Now what's in here? Not another one. Ah! I still hate these guys. One, two, three. One point short from a level up. A fine time to fetch a vault room. Uh, I don't want it. Besides, I've got I've got the zap tap badge, so I really don't need that thing. And a mushroom. Hmm. And lose a honey syrup. Oh, we got a star piece here. Somewhere. Ah, oh, there it is. Hey, open says me, huh? Thank you. Okay, that's a hard plant. And that's a hard plant. Okay. Something's up ahead. And I think I might have a hunch what that something is. Eh, uh, uh, power smash will do. Three of them! If memory serves, yes! Another new enemy! Right, ba right in back there is a White Magic Koopa! White Magic Koopa! HP 11, attack 3, defense 0. Uh, there's a reason why I say White Magic Koopa. There are multiple kinds of Magic Koopas out there. They all have the same uh, HP attack and defense, but depending on their color, it depends on the special ability they've got. So, White Magic Koopa can heal. Yep, you heard me right. A White Magic Koopa can actually he heal his partners. So, that's not good. Nope, it isn't. So, it's recommended to take him out first. Oh, come on, pal. Give me a break here. No. Oh, I've got Power Bomb. Oh, 
Alright, now you're really just getting me mad. You won't survive this one! Yeah, you see how annoying that guy is now, don't you? So I guess I didn't need Power Smash after all. Well, easel come, easel go. Oh no, wait, that's easy. Oh well. And that's it for them. Level up. As promised, people, the next thing I, let I upgrade is HP. And believe me, for what's coming, I got a feeling I am going to need it. Anything in here? Just a coin. Okay, get rid of that. And put I Spy back on. Wow. What a tree. Anything here to be found? Nope. Not as of yet. I wonder what's up this tree. Well, I imagine we'll be finding out in the next part, people. So until next time, catch you later.